Yep. Oh, it is. It. Hell yeah, dude. All right, welcome back to Friday Night Magic here at GameSwap in Mason, Ohio. Commentators tonight are yours truly, Brent Rogers and Luke. What's your last name? Borgermanke. <laughs> Borgermanke? No, no, no. It's Joey Catman. Joey Kaladesh. That's what they what? call me. <laughs> Joey Kaladesh. At the, at the store I used to go to before I started coming here, everybody used to start to call me Joey Wheeler because I was the only <laughs> Joey at the store. <laughs> <laughs> and the, uh, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge series yeah. was really popular. Yeah. Can I call you? I can't even. I can't think of a better name. Oh, they. <laughs> last time I uh, commentated, I was called uh, Babyface Brent. <laughs> Makes sense. Hmm. I buy it. Yeah, because I got Babyface. So I get ID'd all the time, and it's great. He's cheating. I'm just kidding. No cheaters. Boggles hate bears. That's an interesting combination. Boggles hate bears? Yeah. That's... What? No. I don't know, like... I think it could work. I don't think it would be amazing. I don't know why... I don't know the whole list for hate bears, though. How do you not know the whole list for hate bears? Phil's been playing hate bears forever. Phil? No, yeah. he's playing taxes. It's the same deck. Well, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, right. Mac, can they post links in chat? It's an Inger link. I mean, we probably won't be able to see it anyway. So anyway, uh. So I have no idea how this match is gonna go. I know the Bant Spirits deck kind of because I also play a Bant deck. Right. Uh, his is a bit different because he's not playing Knight or Retreat Squirrel. <laughs> yeah, he's actually playing Spirits, not just goofy stuff that's good. <laughs> hey, goofy stuff that, that's good gets there. Yeah, call, it's called Abzan. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Yeah. Don't look at me like that, Luke. Yeah, Pirates seem sweet, though, for Ixalan. I'm I actually, I might play care. Build a Pirate deck. The amount of caring that I have is none. All right. I think you need to care more. I don't. So standard is no. Pat's got a path to exile in hand. That's gonna be completely useless to him in this matchup. One hundred percent. I don't know. Why does Justin like go ham with untapping his lands? He's just like, mm, untap. He's a very excitable person. <laughs> He's uh, going crazy with these fetch and shock lands, though. He's already down to fifteen. Oh man. <laughs> so he's taking four, Dude, I think, I right here. Know. I don't know the, all the enchantments. Five? Jeez. That's a good clock. That's a f good four four turn clock. Turn two, take five. Seems good. See you next round. <laughs> Alright, game two. <laughs> that was a good game. Uh <laughs> Pat searching out a breeding pool here. Uh I really don't know what he could do in this matchup, at least game one. Oh, five. Okay, so he's only doing four. That was the fetch. Okay. Uh, if Pat has engineer explosives in his sideboard, I think that'd really help in this match. Yeah, but this is pre sideboard. I know, but I'm pretty sure Pat's gonna get run over this game. Like he's already taking five. He's probably gonna take more this turn if he puts another enchantment on his creature here. Another hyena umbra. Daybreak coronet. That's a Lord. lot of damage. Doesn't that one also get light? Like, okay, I'm just going to cut out. I think it's flying too. Vigilance, Vigilance and lifelink. lifelink. Four plus a fetch. Okay, so. Matt, I got it. I got it, Matt. Yeah, he's just taking a lot. Like, no, not yet. <laughs> so that's the last card in his hand. <laughs> Justin just needs a rancor, and this is over. Yeah. 
Uh, Drug Skull Captain. It's a pretty good card with your spirits. Unfortunately, not right now. It's Top not. deck. Is that a path? It's no, another Daybreak it's Coronet. Another so. This is brutal. Yeah, this is disgusting. I feel bad for Pat. First time, first time Pat's been here, and he has to fight Boggles. Well, he's 3-0, I think, right? Right now? <clears throat> yeah. So, I think... I think he'll be fine losing this match. Yeah, you're right. So, Boggles is a weird deck in Modern because there's not a lot that most decks can do against it. <laughs> no, it. you're right. Like, I'm honestly surprised you don't see Boggles in top eights a lot more often because nobody really plans for them. I mean, Liliana Veil is fine, but a lot of time they can get Dryad Arbor or they were playing... Last time I talked to Justin, he was playing a guy that like made a soldier token when he came into play, so he could sack that to Liliana instead. Oh, you're so good, Luke. <laughs> Collected company here is going to need to be an amazing company. Queller. Queller doing nothing. Yeah, Queller doing absolutely nothing. Well, I mean, it can block. That's about it. <clears throat> GG. I mean, that's about it. The white cartouche, that's what does it. Double so, Queller. Pat can block for a while, that's for sure, but that's only going to help him until Justin draws like a Rancor or like oh, yeah. something that gives him protection from creatures. <laughs> Dude, Justin's at 53 life. <laughs> so Pat has a huge uphill battle. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty right. sure this game's already over. Like, yeah. If I was Pat, I wouldn't want to show Justin more of the deck I had. True. So I would just scoop it up there. Um. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Oh, phantasmal image can't copy. Phantasmal image? I think it can. I don't it think it can because it. What? Does have a hard time against, uh, and effects. But True. I don't think that's not. I don't think my cloning phone. their hexproof guy is gonna help you at all. Yeah, it would. But uh. Why wouldn't it? They can just bounce off each other for days. Not when they have a bunch of enchantments on them. Phantasm which doesn't cost me all the enchantments on it. Oh, that's true. But, uh, just to take a quick moment to remind you guys about the Patreon. Uh, go there to donate. Helps out the stream a lot. Every dollar you donate goes to improving the stream. Just go to patreon.com slash topdeckproductions. Uh, also, the Twitch subscriptions help a lot. And we also have new merch coming out with our new logo. We got new playmats coming out. We're going to have a new playmat out on the stream table. We're going to have some new new, uh, um, new shirts. Bolt the bird. The bird is like a cartoonish bird. It's getting lightning bolted. And then you see a skeleton, which is great. Um, uh, I, think, I think we definitely need to have a uh, push the high arc. Um, I thought we talked about this. We did, but I'm going to keep saying it till Nelson listens to one of the videos. It's not going to be push the high arc. There's and plenty of other better oh, things yeah, yeah. you want to push. push. The, yeah, push the goif. You're right. Push the goif. No. It'd be Spartan kicked into a hole. You're pushing him with your foot. You're pushing with your foot. Are you not? <laughs> So Push everything. <laughs> Pat's going to want to bring out all of his target removal in this matchup. Uh, Justin, I have no idea what he plays in his sideboard. <laughs> yeah, dude, I don't know anything about Boggles except for, you can't touch me. Uh, like I said before, I think Engine Explosives would be really good in this matchup. For sure. Gets rid of all of his auras on Yeah, them. but still can't take care of the creature. Yeah, but the creature is just a 1-1. One -one. You're not as worried about it. I'm, Dude, I'm freaked out. You're scared of a slippery boggle. A one. <laughs> Have one you seen his face? A one one for a hybrid green. Have blue. you seen that face? I mean, I've seen it. Dude, he's it's got scary. a pointy nose. It's scary, <laughs> dude. It's but hilarious. He's like, he's like, he's like, doesn't even come up to your knee, Cap. <laughs> You're, dude, I know. He's. I love like, that card. He's the like, art on that card is beautiful. He's like as big as a house cat, probably. Or smaller. He's got to be smaller. There's no way. A fat house cat, maybe. If he was fat. You just said smaller. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. 
Dude, I slept all day. I, don't, I need more sleep. That, if you slept all day, you should be fine. You right. Yeah, beating Boggles, even though, like, it's a deck you feel like it should be an auto win just because it seems like one of those decks, but, like... It's not. When you get, like, destroyed by it, you're like, man, that just happened. Yeah, that just happened. So, my, like, when my you, opponent went up to 53 life. When you when you beat them, it's it feels pretty good, actually. It's like beating... I don't know. It's like... Beating any Jund or... No, I don't want to say like that. Like, you... Decks like Jund and Abzan, you play against them all the time. Like, beating them just feels like, you know, another day. I mean, here at the shop, yeah. So, That's true. But, like... It's like beating Tron. Like, beating Tron just feels so good. Oh, God, Tron needs to get banned. They need to ban one of the Tron lands. No, just one. That's never going to happen. I can't take credit for that joke. I, I heard don't, it from somebody else. I don't like Tron either, but I think Tron is fine. No, Tron is not fine. Did you see the mono red Tron list? Blech, my voice cracked there. I, no, I didn't see it. I don't want to see any Tron list. Oh, man. I actually thought about building it. It so, seemed pretty cool. Stop. You They're faithless right. looting, discard warm coil engine. And then trash for treasure, sacrificing like a psalm simulacrum to get back worm coil engine. Seems what happened good. to the avenge deck list? Did uh, it just die out? It was like, oh man, look what can happen for one weekend. And it's like, me, never came up it's again. It's just super inconsistent. I proxied the deck and tried it out. Yeah, remember? And it's just super inconsistent. Uh, there was a version that was posted that was like a Jun version that played Death Shadow. It also yeah. played Gristlebrand with Goyo's Vengeance. And Nick showed me the list, and I was like, this just looks like a hot mess, and I love everything about it. <laughs> Turn one, Noble High Arc. Push it! Push it. Needs to be pushed. Huh? Well, Nick didn't, come with the, Nick didn't come up with the list. You need to see the deck Goldfish. that me and Eric made. It's a five-color deck. <laughs> Dude, huh? it works. It works. It's got... Delver of Secrets. It's got one lightning bolt. That's the only thing for the red. <laughs> it's so, great. Justin's got his turn one boggle. It's not boggle. I mean, it's, it's a hex basically a boggle. Elf. But Pat's on three on turn two, so he could spell Queller whatever Justin tries to suit this elf up with. Another high arc in hand. So, yeah, that's, you know, it's really hard to talk with you when you're not on a mic. I'm on the mic. Yeah, but you're not talking. So. Yeah, you're right, because I'm just waiting. They're just fetching. They're just, they're just shocking, you know, just, just waiting. So, we'll see if Ooh. Pat can find what he needs to get this done. He's going to have to be the super control deck in this matchup, I believe. Or he's going for it. I don't I don't like that. I don't like that play at all. No, I don't either. He's trying to race him and he's going to lose that yeah, race. Yeah, no, Pat's going to totally lose this. Going to lose this race. What? What? <laughs> Uh, I'm pretty sure that is a breeding pool in play. It is. It is a breeding pool. Unless Pat grabbed a nope. Yavi Mine no. Coast on accident. No. It's a breeding pool. Joey, listen. Breeding pool. You're a good guy, but it's a breeding pool. <laughs> uh, we're not sure what Pat is playing in his sideboard. I imagine Blessed Alliance is definitely in his sideboard and came in if it he I had it. I would hope so. Because that's like one of the only cards that I can think of that just wrecks Boggles. Or turn one, Inquisition, with Surgical Extraction. There goes half your creatures. Monastery Mentor and Boggles. Seems okay. I think hmm? you've already played all your stuff before you can get uh, the Mentor down, though. Yeah. Alright, got an enchantment on there. Protection, protection from, from creatures seems so. good seems pretty good against a uh, we creature got, heavy deck we got Luke here as our tell us what the cards say guy who built boggles oh yeah Luke built boggles it's his deck isn't this oh, your man. deck isn't Justin borrowing this from you 
He bought it from you? Okay. With what, all the store credit that he has from comment or running the stream? Yes, sir. Or what I did with Elves and Eric? Uh, I bought him so much uh, Subway till I paid off. <laughs> I'm not sure what Pat played, but it was Stop. something to... Yeah, he played Fragmentize. Jeez. That's a new card that I don't know. <laughs> what? Four or less. Yeah. It's a one white and sorcery. Was it a Kaladesh card? Yes. Yeah, I came back after Kaladesh, so. Still don't know all the new standard legal cards. Oh, but you're so excited to play it. Sorry to play Ixalan. I'm not excited. Kaladesh didn't look that great. So. The Stride Arbor is going to make it hard for Pat to get the Blessed Alliance off if he attacks with it. Uh, yeah, very true. I think what Pat could have done, it, I don't know how well he knows the Boggles deck, but I'm pretty sure Daybreak Coronet, it falls off if there's no other enchantment on the creature. Yes, sir. So if he waited for uh, Justin to suit up with a Daybreak Coronet and then fragmentize the Spirit yeah. Mantle, I think... but. It depends on how long he wanted to wait for it or not. Right. Yeah, Brent, why no excitement for Ixalan? Chat wants to know. Dinosaurs, I'm, man. Pirates and dinosaurs. <laughs> Look. And green merfolk, which is kind of weird. I just don't like standard. It's I not grew, about standard. I, I started learning about modern. That's where I learned magic, okay? So magic, modern is my baby. Standard's been bad in general. Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I'd say standard is better than modern at the moment, but standard is definitely a lot better than it has been the last few months. That's what I keep hearing, and I'll probably just be like, sure. Here's what standard's all about limited. I am awful at limited. I, yeah, so I quit. I think the only limited format I was ever actually any good at was triple Innistrad, original Innistrad. That format was great because you just draft blue white. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Justin just pathed in response to the Coco. Shouldn't be shouldn't Pat be searching for his searching through his library first? I think he's in response to the path text. No, 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 no. Pat went to Coco. Justin said in response path. Uh. He didn't. He, yeah, it's yeah, a May, but we got to make sure that he doesn't search after Coco. So, Phantasm Image is a weird one in this deck. I don't know why. <clears throat> so. Yeah, I don't know why it's in here, but... Ooh, what if he so makes a Pat copy? Just didn't search with Path to Exile. If Phantasmal... Can Phantasmal copy Dryad Arbor? And be a land. Yeah, I can. What? That's dude. That's what he should do. All the ramp. I don't know why he'd copy that over Noble Hierarch when get the Exalted triggers. True. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Copies the Lord. Okay, that makes sense. Oh yeah, because Drug Skull Captain gives all your spirits hexproof, I believe. Yeah. So if you copy Drug Skull Captain, then none of your creatures can be targeted. Seems good. So it's like Drug Skull Captain Geist five through six Saint or whatever. Draft. I don't know how many copies they play. Geist is pretty good right here. All right, Justin. All right, Justin, what you got? Oh, oh, Justin's just like, nah, I'm yeah. out. I'm going outing. to game three. So see if Pat can remain undefeated here. He's looks doing like, pretty good in this. Looks like Pat just took a big sigh of relief. Yeah, this is Pat's first. Time here at Game Swap. So first time here at Game Swap. Here in Mason. It's not Fairfield, but oh Milford, that's what it is. In Milford. Just I'll just stop. Oh hey hey tell Pat, tell Pat that we want some pizza. Is that pizza or Jimmy John's? No, that's pizza. Yeah, it's definitely Dude, Jimmy pizza. John's is gross. Get out. You're right. I don't go to Jimmy John's. Marco's Pizza. That's fine. Yeah, Marco's isn't the best. Tell, tell Pat that he's a cool guy 
and the commentators want some pizza. I'll start yelling at him from back here. Hey, Matt. So this Matt. is a uh, this is a match that I think very much comes down to who's on the play. I mean, if Justin didn't even just Justin just didn't really get a good start. Well, I don't know what was in his hand, but blowing up the spirit mantle definitely set him back. Uh, I if his hand was full of daybreak cornets, so. Oh yeah, so, um, yeah. So Matt, can you just tell Pat to to give me a slice of pizza? You need to stop. You need to stop. So, are you not hyped for pizza? Uh, not really. I've kind of uh, had my fill of pizza. That's fair. You're wrong, but um, so yeah, game three. Game yeah. Game three. Yeah, game two. Justin just did not uh, see a good hand. I think if Pat gets a turn one dork. It definitely will keep him in the game. I, like, sure. If he doesn't have a turn one guy, I think the prob he's gonna have a real problem this game. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Uh, yeah, we should be tailgating. We tailgate twenty four seven. That's Ohio boys. I've Woo! never tailgated. You're wrong. I've lived in Ohio my whole life. <laughs> Alcohol. <laughs> OSU can. Can lose or win as many games as they want. I don't give a shit. Whoa. Whoa, that's blasphemy. I don't care about hey. the Bengals. Don't care. I don't care about the Browns. Look, 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 look. Hey, hey, you and me right now. I don't care as long as I get my booze. That's all I gotta say. Right? That's fair. Brent the drunkard. That's what they should call me. Are they both going to six? Uh, looks like it. So. <laughs> Watch. <laughs> we got plenty of people here at the store that love the Bengals and love Ohio State. I'm just not one of them. Used to be a Bengals fan, but then I was like, ah, I like video games. <laughs> well, my dad grew up outside of Pittsburgh, so you know who I grew up having to watch. Ew. Why am I commentating with you? Because you chose me. You texted uh, me this morning and asked, hey, you want to do commentary? I I text, I texted like four or five people. It was supposed to be Eddie first. Well, Eddie And then he's like, I want to play. And I'm like, that's fair. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. This is great commentary. Absolutely. Nothing's happened on screen, so we're just bullshitting. I mean, what else are we supposed to do? Both to six. Watch, they both go to four. Go to four. I, I'm i skipping five. They're going to go straight. Nope, Justin's keeping. Jets and Mets fan. There's always next year, yeah. <laughs> I got – there's a guy, an old guy at my work who's a super Yankees fan. Oh, God. And uh, Baseball's so boring. They gave us these, like, Cracker Jacks one year <laughs> just as, like, something to hand out during break. You know, I want – And uh, I opened up a Mets sticker in one of mine, and I, like, put it inside of his lunchbox. <laughs> So I want to re I want you to realize that not a single game it was a turn one boggles. It's always been this elf. Yeah, no slippery boggle. I like the boggle better. Pat going turn one Gavney Township does not bode well. I don't think. No. So Pat's Pat's gonna be in a really tough spot. Yeah, and he's already taken three. Oh, from this he's rancor. he's gonna be taking he's gonna be taking another. Pff, I'm calling five. I don't know how five. According to SCG, it's green, white, hexproof is the name of the deck. That's that's dumb. That's wrong. It's boggles. Tell tell SCG they're wrong. I'll I'll talk to them. There was another deck that they were just <laughs> you rug that had a name, but they were not calling it by its name. I'm trying to remember what it was. I have no idea. I can't think of it right now. <laughs> elves? <laughs> no. It's not elves. It's people with pointy ears. <laughs> Cartouche. So. <laughs> Yep, here's the guy that... It's the Doge. 
Saltai Delver. Another Rancor. Oh, man. Jeez. Yeah, I do not see. Pat's not in a good spot. Uh, is that a land? Was that a land? I can't tell. Did he only have one land? Yeah, I guess he kept the one lander. You keep cutting out, by the way. Yeah, well, I'm trying to make it so it doesn't. All right, it's good. Just don't move it. Keep the... Is that a second cartouche? Oh, man, that's... Matt, I have been. I know, this is nasty. I know how it works. I know how this thing works. <laughs> I don't even think Blessed Alliance saves him now because he just attacks with the, yeah, with the he's soldier just, token. Yeah. There's how big is that elf now? Two, three. Hey, there's another land. Seven. Seven power. He's got to have something. Nope. That's oh, game. wow. That was a fast. Oh, no. Uh, well, that's Pat's first loss. Man. Huh? But they have pizza to console them. And I you guess. know what we have? We got merchandise. Tell me, Brent, what kind of merchandise we, we got? We got shirts and we got playmats on the way. We got Bolt the Bird shirt, which is a cartoonish bird. It's getting bolted. And it's gonna it's like a skeleton y uh, cartoonish bird. And then we also have shirt uh playmat that has our logo. And uh yeah, so if you guys want to help out the stream you can check out our Patreon at patreon.com slash Top Deck Productions. You can also follow and subscribe here on Twitch. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash Top Deck Productions. Um, you know, any any anything that helps us will go directly towards the stream. Um, and and what? I was just gonna say, you 25 minutes me? till for the round. Uh, we'll again, we'll look for another uh, match to put up here before we go into round five. So. Try and stay tuned. See what happens. I'd like to see what happens. I'd like to see me get a piece of pizza.